Well, the aerodynamic process really starts with, with an idea. You take an idea through, um, through uh, the design process through to CFD, which is a computational uh, wind tunnel environment. And typically ideas will then come through CFD. If they look interesting, they'll then come up to the wind tunnel. So we're always looking to improve the efficiency of the car. And by that, I mean maximizing our downforce and reducing our drag. Well, the tunnel works in that we've got a, a model suspended on a strut, and that measures all the forces. We have internal pressure measurement systems. We, we simulate as best as we can a car moving through the air, although the model is itself fixed. From the front wings all the way through to the rear wing, they're all defined and evaluated in the wind tunnel. And generally, we're looking to always improve the characteristics. So taking the driver feedback, and then feed that back through our design process and look to improve the areas where the car is weak. What's most satisfying is when you have perhaps new engineers join us and they have their first ideas and they get parts through the wind tunnel, through CFD and then onto the car. I think that's very satisfying.